Every morning, my days start extremely early at 3 a.m. After I wake up in the morning, I brush my teeth, take a shower, write a two-page journal entry about my ambitions in life, and then I finish things off with a five-mile run. Just kidding, guys. I don't actually do any of the stuff I just mentioned, so let's get into my real morning routine. This isn't going to be another one of those fake day in the life videos on YouTube because honestly, if you get up at 3 a.m. every day and write a two page journal entry, you're kind of a loser, at least in my opinion. In all seriousness, I usually wake up in the morning around 7.30 a.m. and the first things I always do to start my day, at least lately, is day trade stocks. I have recently been getting more and more into the business of day trading because it's an amazing way to gamble your money without making anyone concerned you're an addict. Unfortunately, today is a weekend, so I can't day trade, but yesterday I made $60 while sitting in English class, which is absolutely nothing to complain about. After I get a quick thrill in in the morning from day trading stocks, I usually go over to my computer to see how the channel's performing, and boom, then I get right into filming videos. Today I'm going to be filming parts of two different videos for this YouTube channel and the first one is going to be where we go to a bunch of Walmarts and search for some pools to resell on Amazon FBA. As for the second video I'm going to be filming, well, it's going to be all about Postmates and delivery driving. So we plan to spend a solid four to five hours today filming those different types of videos to see how much money we can make. And I'll be sure to film any behind the scenes footage for this vlog right here. Starting things off, I think we're going to go ahead and film the Amazon FBA video. So I'll see you guys as soon as we pull up to the first Walmart location. If few moments later. All right, guys, so quick little update. It is currently 1.30 p.m. in the afternoon, and well, this morning was kind of rough because we literally went to three Walmart locations looking for pools to purchase to resell. Unfortunately, none of the Walmarts had any pools, and to make matters even worse, we actually filmed inside of each of the Walmarts, but the microphone, for some reason, sounded like a potato. Excuse me, do you guys know where your pool section would be? Toys, if you have any. Toys, you don't think you have any pools? Okay. Despite these rough circumstances this morning, we are going to go ahead and keep pushing forward by doing a quick two hour session on Postmates and starting things off, I already got a delivery. So we're gonna go ahead and drive 14 minutes to go pick up some food for someone and then bring it to their house. I'm gonna walk you guys through this first delivery and well, the goal for this two hour session is to make at least $30 in revenue and I'm pretty sure we'll be able to do it. We just pulled up to the place to pick up the Postmates order. The name of the business is called The Burger Den. It's a simple pickup order, so we just have to go inside, pick up the food, and then bring it to the customer. We just completed our first Postmates delivery of the day. And as you guys can see on the screen right here, we ended up earning $2.30 before tip. Honestly, that's the lowest I've ever gotten paid for a single Postmates delivery, but hopefully we got at least like a two or $3 tip on that delivery. But next we're gonna do a few more deliveries and then we're gonna finish off the day. We are now on to our second delivery of this video and essentially we need to go into Buffalo Wild Wings and order three meals for a customer. This is going to take us quite a while because first off, we had to drive 15 minutes to this Buffalo Wild Wings location and now we have to order the food, wait for it, and then bring it to the customer. I hope this delivery actually pays us well, but we'll have to wait and see. As you guys can see, after waiting for like 15 minutes, we officially got the food from Buffalo Wild Wings. Now we need to drive like eight minutes down the road to go deliver it to the customer. Delivery number two is officially completed. It took us quite a while from the first delivery. They're literally an hour apart, but nonetheless, we got $4.02 before tip. I'm really hoping this guy tips us because I put a lot of effort into that delivery, so I'm hoping we get paid. We're probably gonna do only one more delivery today for this video, and then I'm gonna head back home. Wow, guys, that was definitely a long day of driving for Postmates for not a lot of profit in return as we spent a grand total of two hours driving for Postmates doing three total deliveries 
and we made $11.72, not accounting for tips. So after tips and everything, I'm projecting we made $26, which is still absolutely terrible. Anyways, guys, the next thing I want to get into now that we finished driving for Postmates is a question I always answer in all of my vlog style videos, and that is how much money did you make today? Well, starting things off, I'm currently running two main businesses, which is day trading that earned me about $0 today since the market was closed, and also Amazon FBA, which made me $170 in revenue today or $45 in profit. In case you guys are curious how I was able to earn so much money with Amazon FBA today by basically doing nothing, well, let's just say the waffle makers I bought in this video, link somewhere up here, have made me a lot of money so far. On top of my Amazon FBA earnings, I also obviously make money with YouTube, and when you go into my YouTube studio app, you guys can see I've earned around $125 yesterday, so that's absolutely not bad. On top of my YouTube ad revenue, I also make money with my channel by affiliate marketing, and that income equates to about $60 so far today. All in, accounting for Postmates as well, my earnings throughout this day in the life video comes out to $241.72. But wait, the day isn't over yet since I want to try and make some money gambling, baby. Welcome to Gambling with an Edge. I just put essentially all of the money I made today in an online gambling website by the name of Rubet because why not? Let's make this video a little bit interesting. I have $200 in my Rubet account and we're going to be betting it all on a hand of blackjack. All right, guys, I'm officially all in on a round of blackjack. I'm honestly super nervous. We better win this or else I'm going to be kind of sad tonight, but I think we're going to win. We just got a king. Let's hope that the cards keep getting good. Ooh, I got a king and an eight. I think I'm going to stand. Stand for sure. We're winning this baby we are winning this come on come on i want to win so bad if we lose i'm gonna be stressed out okay let's see what the dealer got 13 oh we're winning this for sure let's go 394 dollar gain Woo! Yeah! With that extra $200 gain, I just got gambling on Rubet. That brings our total profit for the day to 441 bucks, which is absolutely not bad for, as I like to say, an 18-year-old CEO. If you guys enjoyed this video, please be sure to give it a like. I know the past two weeks of content hasn't really been too crazy, but well, tomorrow we are going to be going to Chicago to collab with two of my YouTube friends, so that's going to be super awesome since I'm going to be filming so many crazy videos for you guys, so stay tuned for that. The first Chicago video is going to be coming out on Monday. So I will see you Monday with an absolute banger. Peace out.